Hello all you beautiful people and we're going back into the dunge darkest dungeon and if my voice is breaking it's because I'm in puberty vet or because we just lost four people to the wise and the hag which is actually a very easy encounter I think. Part of the loss was because we didn't plan it, we, we didn't know what we were getting into but now we do. Apparently the pot, the crock pot she puts your heroes in does not kill them so it's about at one health. So we're gonna work around that. We do not have, well, we might have the resources to mount our revenge campaign, but for now we're gonna, we're gonna train up our new people. We've hired everyone we can. We're gonna bring these back up to, uh, bring these guys up to level one, hopefully. Tolls isn't that important of a deal and won't even be named that much. Who died? My God, a lot of people died. Hey, Ross is now... No, you're not Ross. Ross is now... Ronin Child. And Tulls, I guess you can be Dirk Diggler. Because I'm running out of names. I don't want to... I'll tab just to look for a name. So we're going to name her him again uh, for... I can't do it to English. We're going to name him after what I can only assume is a male porn star. If he isn't, someone better take that. Light below 25 to his speed. We're not going to go into the dark just yet. Harcourt, what do we name you? Well, you can be Johnny Tapia. After the villain in Bad Boys 2, I, I just like that name. Every time I have to think of a name, Johnny Tapia comes up. Dispomania, intense craving for alcohol. Isn't that just alcoholism or is that like an actual mania? We're going to send myself in along with Jesse Jane, Dirk Diggler, and Ronin Child back into... Well, not into the wield. We're not, that's not the best place for them. We're going to go into the ruins. Because one, there's a level 1 encounter there. Kind of going deep into it, but that's okay. And if we're bringing these four in, we may as well send a few into the sanitarium. Thiru, so, do you have any problems we should fix? Dark Temptation. Oh, we should fix that. That explains why he couldn't hit shit last time. Can we upgrade anything in the sanitarium? Increase the number of slots to two. Excellent. Pudgy Pooba, do you need anything? We should probably not bring all level ones anyway. So we're gonna send in Diggler here to see if he has anything bad. Just in case we decide to go dark on it. We may as well. It's, oh wait, Stitch. Stitch is far more useful. Blood first. He stun resist. Let's, let's fix that out. The shocker. Turn to pink one in the stink. Level 3, no. The Warrens got out of hand. These used to have level 1 encounters, but I guess that's over. Jesse da Jane is gonna be our number 2. Bleed out. What the? If it bleeds, bleed out. Oh, okay. Two different abilities. She likes attacking the first two. I like attacking the first two. That's also a big note with that encounter was that we couldn't ever get. Uh, to the hack unless we attack the back line which made my Jesse Jane strategy kind of useless but we're gonna work on that Ronin child I should have among the many things I should have done was give her party heal wow we don't have money at all that was a mistake on my part I actually think I just borked myself I should pay more attention can I sell anything to you madam no we're just poor now? Okay. Mm-hmm. This is actually really fucking good. We had the money. And it's a long adventure into the dark. With no money. Or food. Is this short? Yeah, I think I just fucked myself by sending... Can I get a refund? That was stupid. That was... That was... No, not sure. What have I done? Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. And this is something that requires a lot of supplies. We're gonna bring in the Pooba. And Jesse Jane. Pooba is fine. We have some sustain. Well, okay, we'll just, I guess, bet on good luck here. I guess we're playing dark. Fine by me. Shit. 
And it was all going so well. I didn't know you could retreat from combat. Where's that button? I would have retreated like a moment one of us went down. Symbols. Collect the scattered scraps of faith. Uh, let's go and here. Let's check out our map. Masses. Huge map. Hopefully you get to the relics really early. Yeah, let's open that up. Volumes are dull and uninteresting. Hopefully my level 2 self can deal with this. Oh well. I was hoping not to touch that. Resisting. That's fine. It's gonna get real dark real fast. Although I have been wondering how much of a difference a dark run would make. I guess we're about to find out. Priority should switch her out with Pudgy Pooba. At least switch their positions, not leave. It's supposedly a level 1 dungeon anyway, so we should be fine. We can probably be carried by myself, or at least my in game version, or the one named after me. Not even my in game version, really. Wow, can't you do anything? Oh, no targets, but at least we always have an option. It is not ideal, admittedly very bare bones what am I hoping for I'm hoping that we survive all of this that's one money is important so we will retreat at the first sign of trouble and we do have an escape route in the camp what I'm looking to do right now is to keep us as healthy and as bright as possible so that we are in a great position when it gets darker more crits, yes. More loot, yes. But also more danger and stress. Family heirlooms, that's good. Keep the light up. More heirlooms, that's good. Maybe the game is having some mercy on us. Nope. Alright. That's nice. Thanks for clarifying your position on this entire mercy issue. In that you have none. That's good. We'll explore the... If we're lucky, another relic is here at the end. If we're unlucky, well, I, it won't be and there'll be just a bunch of fights with no real gain, aside from experience. And while experience is a gain, we're not looking at that book. <laughs> I, I've never... That's never gone well. Well, it has, but not worth it. The juice ain't worth the squeeze. Starve, I guess. 20% damage? I think we're gonna have to leave. The body against itself, weakening the mind. But at least we're leaving with food, uh, with money. We can go on another adventure that'll go much better. If we leave early, I guess this will be a double embarkation episode. I just pissed on my game. Jesus. I didn't think that through. I need to pay attention. Bare minimum. Pay fucking attention to what's happening. Let that be a lesson to you. Well, I don't think it'll be a lesson to you because that's the basic principle. Pay attention to the numbers. And I did not. Even when we camp, we're going to starve a little. Okay. 875. Let's hope for a thousand gold before we leave. And we're forced to leave. Rather. This isn't by choice. Stop starving you. On the brink, facing the abyss. That was fast. Hmm, that's bad. Eye gouging bad. Let's have our occultist look at this. Eh, there's a fight here. She'll probably die, but... Yeah, you see? Probably gonna die. Where is the run button? Thank you. For living. Thank you for not shooting her. Injury and despondence. Set the stage that would have saved us in that Wizened Hag cowardice. encounter. Because of that party heal. I'm not giving up. Is that irrational? Is this a good idea? Probably not. Heal for zero, huh? That's interesting. Good news is I'll probably get out of this. 6 to 13. Fantastic. We're leaving after this fight, by the way. We are so done. We are so done. Should have killed that, maybe, because he's going to shoot our back line. No? Good. Thanks for cooperating, game. Thanks for letting me try to salvage my way out of this. What are we doing? It's not so bad. Good. Just stab me. That's fine. 
Oh, that can go south so fast. So we're just gonna go on the offensive. I think if they're in front, they only have Baron the Jab available. Oh, that's beautiful. That's... That did. There will be no mother, superior otherwise. Huh, that's... Did she hurt herself? Did she jab herself in the badge? That's... That's painful. Like, that's... The implication, right? Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Round three. And we're about to leave. Not gonna use that shit. It's a good ability to use weird reconstruction when you're ahead, but not when you're behind like this. It's actually quite useless on someone who's already at Death Star because it can kill them. Stabby stabby. Thank you. Thank you for finishing that fight. Now we're all going to be stressed when we leave. But you know what? We're also going to be alive. Thank you. It's super useful. Out of here. Wounds to be tended. We can't even heal them because we're out of money. What new, what fresh hell do you have? That's really bad. She's now useless, essentially. Well, not really useless, but... Wow, that's also bad. That's okay. That's... This is super bad. Gift of the healer, huh? Alright. I didn't even get the levels we wanted out of his. Mm. The poor caretaker. I fear his long-standing duties here have... <laughs> duties. Him. We can't send them back to heal, but we can hire more people. Maybe get some more room in our... More arrive. Too many crusaders, too many crusaders. In this domain of the damned. Well, they're not going out in the field anyway, Dirk Diggler is. There's not much we can do, and before I end up spending on something that I can't afford, we're gonna send people out. Tonkos is level 1, great in the second position. Pudgy Pooba is great in the back position. Stitch is okay over here with the little dancing abilities, which is fine. It's okay. We'll get to you, alright, we'll get to you. We just need something... Oh, come on, something forgiving. Alright, let's, let's go back into the ruins. Get some money. We'll be okay, we've got a lot of damage on this team. We should be fine. And now we have enough torches and food. Okay, eight, sure. Okay, it's kind of risky. We're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna try to recover from our big mistakes. Actually, like, this is the part of the game, uh, part of most games that I like, just recovering. Because bullying the game isn't fun. Once familiar. Now, boring. It's just... Well, it is fun. There are some days where you just want to bully some, uh, where you just want to bully the game, but for the most part... You have a mark? Excellent. We have a combo. But just fighting up, it's like they're participating. You don't want to, you know, fuck someone and have them just lie down there like a cold fish. Which, I guess, is the term that they used back in the day. But, you want them to participate, making the fucking more enjoyable for both parties. And if you like them kind of stiff, I'm not gonna judge you. I mean, you're totally into corpses. Or just women who aren't into it. That's such a weird thing. I don't want them to enjoy it. It, it affects my enjoyment of the, the sex. Don't do that. i tell you what, you know. Stuff like Mercurial. What does that do? Resist affliction 5%. That's okay. It's just more fun for everyone involved. They're participating. That's all I'm trying to say. A fight, excellent. These guys give us a lot of stress. Pudgy Pooba is already maxed out. I didn't notice that. I'm an idiot. Oh god, this is the last recording I'm doing tonight. <laughs> this is this is the last one. Good chance to kill. Excellent. Executed with impunity. We might bring the bounty hunter along next time. Good, 66 percent. Good odds, 8 to 16. Well, if it hit, he, he's not afflicted with rabies anymore, so he should be fine. It's weird that you really have to dig for party ballad. Rock out. 
Heh, <laughs> works for me. Uh, let's hex you and prepare you for our bounty hunter. He's stressed already. There's not... You can't do much to him anymore. Oh, alright. I guess you can do that. Abusive, eh? As long as he doesn't start hurting my other characters. Chop, chop. Oh, come on. Make an effort. You're not getting a Christmas bonus this year. Yeah, I know it, it, I know it's February, but, you know, it's never too early to tell you off. 23 needs a good roll. 6 to 12 doesn't need that much of a good roll. But you've been doing well dealing with a back row time cost. Oh well, worth a shot. Do you move? No, you don't. You don't move. This is actually pretty good. Ah, you didn't... Oh, you are bone, so I guess you wouldn't... I am not an insect. I'm a man. I'm an jester man. Dazed. Reeling. That's alright. That shouldn't affect us too badly in this encounter. You know what? Enough of As your shit. Have a tentacle. A faint hope blossoms. Do I have to suck your dick? I will suck your dick if you hit this. this I didn't mean it too bad, it's a done. No quarter. Dicks just aren't my thing, I guess. Maybe I just haven't met the right penis. Maybe if I met the right penis, I'd be okay with it. Seven, could have used that a while ago. Heroic end, huh? Why? Why are you so... Well, let's try. Now I debuffed myself. Fantastic. Revenge, no. It's alright. Great for bosses. Okay, good. Good. Fix your formation. Move to the next room. We will explore that part first and just walk back. That's okay, we have enough sub Oh! That's my bad. I saw that, I didn't stop. Ambushed by foul invention. Entirely my fault. Stashed arrows. Keep it bright. Keep us healthy. I'm actually tempted to let it drop a little. Because we do need the loot. Eat. Didn't bring a shovel this time, so I guess you're gonna be stressed digging through shit. Why do you get stressed over that? Passage. Hey, we're not children. And did they fix that? Because there, there were a lot of complaints on the Reddit about how stress makes them talk a lot more and slows down the game because you have to stop and listen to their bitching. Uh, he bitched a little and we didn't stop. Workable. Yeah, we're gonna stick with this plus loot. Just a little more loot and a little more crit. Mm. An urn, eh? An occultist should enjoy this. Wait, we have holy water. No need to risk that shit. If only treasure could staunch the flow of other worldly <laughs> so get stressed just because something happened. Ooh. Why do you think you're here? I don't think we're gonna wipe them in this turn even if he attacks, so we're gonna add revenge. Now we're gonna use his revenge ability. Start using buffs. Maybe that's how this is all gonna work out. If you start playing smarter. Was that was that the narrator who went Ah oh. I was hoping to hurt you. Slice off, won't hit him. Party ballad. Maybe we can run with a buff team next. I gotta find out the name of that porn star whose dick is kind of curved funny. And then we can name the team after that. Die. Yes, thank you. Thank you for obeying my commands. How about... Harvest, eh? Bleed. Okay, so announcing what you want to happen doesn't work. Exactly, anyway. 8 to 16, good odds. I'll take them. Destroyed. Mortals fighting turtles, what dull amusement. I assume that is the tone that he is using because he is using. Oh, wow. Injury and despondence set the stage for heroism. Wow. 
Huh. Well, I hope you don't bleed yourself. That works. Would have killed him in one shot. Bastard. Let's have a better. Good miss, good miss. More of that, please. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. The pack doesn't contain loot. A shovel. Could have used that a while ago. Let's keep the light. Because I don't think we're gonna. Yeah, that's that's what I hoped. That we wouldn't encounter anything there. We can we can rest in that room. We are doing I hesitate to say okay. That never fucking works out. You gotta stop reading books. In real life, you know, books are fucking fun. Hero surprise, stress, amount of accuracy and damage. That is not worth the trade off. In case there is an encounter here, which I hope there isn't. And the map actually says there isn't. I hope that these two don't have encounters. Hmm. Kind of a risk with two encounters ahead because there, because there are two encounters ahead. We're gonna go ahead and set camp. A spark without kindling is a goal without. Full meals for everyone, and let's get the healing wound care for you. Reduce stress by ten. Wow. One companion increased by twenty. Eh, no, not a good. Every rose has its farm. All right. Every night has its dawn. Big fan of that song. Fuck you. And you spent your action for it? Alright. Hope someone else has a heal. Well, that's it. We will reduce... Who are we gonna stress out? You. Stress yourself out. You can't. Fantastic. Hmm. Heal 30% plus 5 speed. Oh my god! The least you can do is fucking participate. Let's add to your accuracy at least. Everything can be killed with a well placed button. Let's rest. I hate you. I fucking hate you, Pudgy Poopa. We have not used the last of our food. We have. That is absolutely not happening. That is. That didn't happen. Alright. You can hear a dog. That, that's Sherlock for those who are visiting the channel for the very first time. He is a dog and likes telling people that yes, he is a dog. The utility on that attack is amazing. Stop! Stop causing trouble! <laughs> Come on! I just want to... Fight our way back from this hole that we've dug ourselves into. Alright, even with a buff you're gonna miss, huh? Do you hear the voices too? Don't fret. Okay. I'm not gonna beg to you, game. Not gonna beg. But I am gonna pray a little. Ballad up. Let's pull you, maybe we can kill you. That's a good kill. You abusive son of a bitch. It's like you're in a MOBA team. Ha ha! There go the dogs. I should really rework you. Let's bring you to the front, make your abilities useless if we're lucky. Excellent. You are, he is a tougher than everyone else. But... 6 to 12, on a good roll we'll kill him. That, that's a good roll we were talking about. Ah, uh, fine. 65, 65. Actually, it still might kill them. Killed one, that works for me. Back to basics. Let's go to. Let's collect the bounty. A devastating blow. De-stress. That's good. 
Okay, good progress. Dog's angry again. Creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. These books again. Christ. Give me a second. And we're back. Although for you that may have just been a second, for me that was a good 15 minutes. And I want to make this clear. I may have sounded annoyed and I was kind of irritated. But I do love my dogs. I really do. I'd be heartbroken if anything happened to them. But I do also understand that dog owners out there will know, pet owners, that animals don't give a shit what you're In doing. In Radiance, may we find victory. And they just like barking. They're very vocal. If, if anything interests them, bang! They're off. Barking. Not giving a shit. That's good. This is a good turn for us. See? They're on the way again. Actually, they're not the only things you might hear today. You may also hear... My neighbors are apparently throwing a party. A single party, because this is being recorded at the night of Valentine's Day. More just finding mortals with dull amusement. And, you know, they're getting pretty loud. I can't hear them, which probably means that you're not gonna hear them at all. Because what I hear is apparently a lot more than what you hear. But the point is, let's pull you to the front. That's the point. Make you unable to use your little quarrel attack. Finish him. Fantastic, you did finish him. Actually, you don't even think you're gonna hear most of the dogs over the harvest. That's fine. No, it isn't. We're gonna make you a full support later on. If you can hear that, that's only one dog. That is Sherlock. A little Shih Tzu who loves to bark. One, eh? Better than nothing. I was barking at some, but he never really starts a fight. At least not with, you know, other animals. He just kind of likes looking at them and thinking, Hey, have you seen me? I'm a dog. Ooh. Let's take a look at your abilities, see if they will work on the third slot. Yes, they will. So I feel safe to move him back to the back row. No? Huh? That's... That's a, that is an option you can take. But not something that I truly that I appreciate. Remind yourself level. that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. But we didn't get affected by it. We're gonna make the rounds. We're gonna take these four rooms and go up. Hopefully by this room over here, we'll be finished with this dungeon, and we can leave with a victory. Oh yeah! <laughs> you think you're so clever? You almost got me. Damn it! Mechanical hazards. Possessed by evil intent. Don't talk to me about that. I don't want to talk about it. Don't, don't go in there. Okay, good. Okay, good. Don't talk to me about it. <laughs> I, I thought I was so clever. I was wrong. In the first one, we're, we're going to do in a fight is have you use weird reconstruction on our on Toyn Claus. Who, by the way, is based on a person who believes that... Well, then, I don't think if he really believes it. I think he was speaking facetiously. But the point is, yeah, Caesar Milan. He had this dream where Caesar Milan was talking to a cat and, you know, shaking it back and forth. Like, I, under I understand you. And the cat's just freaking out because Caesar Milan is there. Maybe just excited that a celebrity was talking to the cat. Well struck. Anyway, we had that conversation over the breakfast buffet. Amazing stuff, by the way. I forgot the name of the buffet, but it had very good runny eggs and meat, which is really all that you're asking for. Heal? Two is better than zero. That is, it's, it is mathematically infinitely better than zero. So I'll take it. Could have been nothing. This expedition at least promises success. Thank you, narrator, for telling me that this may promise success. Totally the kind of thing I want to hear right now. Ambiance is not sweeping at all. We're running out of torches, which is not necessarily bad because we're only looking at one fight in the next three corridors and two rooms. We do not have a shovel, I think, so this might kill somebody. Without no, tools of iron, you must rely lost their on shit. flesh and okay, indefatigable so purpose. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna rock out with your cock out. You, you're the prancing fop. You're a jester. You you are the prancing fop. We're also out of food. I hope we don't starve again. That's not a... It's getting dark. Alright. We desperately need 
this excursion to go well. Or we're gonna be so far behind that we might not make it work anymore. Am I here? Yes I am. I am in the corridor. Good. Air dooms, good. More resources to work with. You're not gonna die here, problem. Oh, spiders. I have considered returning to town and I have measured it. I have measured our needs and found that your safety isn't worth it. Really? Thank you. Thank you for salvaging that situation. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Vestals are so goddamn strong in this game. Because they have an ability that lets them attack and create light. <sighs> yeah, we're out of here. <laughs> the great I ruins I belong to, walk and go to us. To that and we will icon, find we're whatever do that. We're not going to push hold. our luck because we've already lost three. We've lost a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a lot of air rooms. That's nice. Thank you, thank you. What fresh hell have we gotten ourselves into? Wasting sickness, we should get rid of that ASAP. Unquiet might, may not meditate one time. See, here's the problem. While we do have some money to work with, we do not have enough. In truth, I cannot to tell how much time has time, passed I think. since I sent Check that our, letter. Our next embarkation before we plan out. I'm hoping for some short dungeons. Thank you. Thank you, short dungeon. I can work with this. Well, this is all happening, you get some stress relief. Off guard is super bad. The runs is super bad. So I guess our Vestal is out of... Is going to be out of commission for a while. Both are pretty bad. Let's get rid of the runs first. And let's set my, send myself to the transept to pray to a higher power. Jesse Jane to appropriately be brought by Romania. We're gonna fix your hieromania. Uh, you're being off guard because that will get you killed. And I think I need you. Bruce, you're not until you. I'll think of names for you later. Sanitarium, no. Stitch is super stressed, so we need to get rid of that. Bad gambler cannot gamble. So we're gonna send you to the bar. And even if we send Pudgy Pooba in. I believe that no, we won't have enough. So I guess that's that's gonna have to do it. We're still in a very bad position, but much better than when we started with. And I, that's really something I got ourselves in uh, the team into, not ourselves, I guess. Anyway, that'll do it for this episode of Darkest Dungeon. I want to record more, but that Valentine's party is gonna get loud. And do you really want to see your neighbors, you know, try to hit in each other? I don't. I don't want to hear it either. But anyway, the point is, if you like, chuckled, or even enjoyed my suffering, please like the video because it'll show your appreciation and I know what I'm doing right. And if you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. This has been Patinator, and I'll see you next time.